So in the last part of this series, we have created API credentials for Google Cloud Vision API. In this video, we will implement it in, into our custom PHP project. For doing so, we have to install Composer into our machine. As I am using Windows machine, I can download, I can install it through Composer setup. Let's run it. Next, select your PHP version and then next, no proxy here, install. And finish. So, so now you can check whether the composer is successfully installed into your computer or not by just typing composer into your machine. If you get dump like this, it means the composer is successfully installed and now you have to do is to change the directory of command prompt to your working directory which is in my case is htdocs in here what you need to do is to require something which is composer require google forward slash cloud vision what composer is doing here is to fetches fetches the library is needed needed for this google cloud vision package as soon as the libraries are downloading, there's the vendor folder is filling with those libraries. So the nice part of Composer is here uh, is that it it create an auto load file which which when we require it into our project it will include all the libraries at once into our project so to do this I am creating a init.php file and just I need to require vendor slash autoload.php Then what I then what I have to do is to simply use Google Cloud Vision Vision Client and initialize it to the variable Vision and Vision Client and of course it is a new Vision Client and it needs key file. The key file is same API credential file service account key file which I have dumped into this working directory like this service account key and I am um, I am including it it has to be JSON, JSON decoded and I am doing file get contents of the key.json Now I have a uh, image uh, to process through this. So uh, first I have to create a family photo resource. Family photo resource. You can change its variables name whatever you like. I just need to open this resource as a stream. Its name is image dot jpg and its mode is read only then I have to create a vision image for this in which I pass the family photo resource and the parameters for which I need the info from this image I need face detection info and uh, I need web detection simple now let's annotate this by result is equivalent to vision annotate image and 
let's war dump the result let's check our code local host 8000 and init uh, it is saying something google cloud core exception invalid value at request web detection oh under, underscore is missing now let's refresh it and we have our dump this dump contains face detection info and the web detection info of that image meaning face where where is the nose where is the lip where is the eyebrows and the web de detection info contains where, what are the possible places in web that this image can be found 